The Texas Education Agency officially approves an in-district charter to take over Mendez Middle School in Southeast Austin. The school was facing closure, but today the new director tells KXAN education reporter Aaron Cargyle, let their reinvention begin. Just about finished everything, so I don't have much left to do. It's move-in day for the new director of Mendez Middle School's T-STEM Academy. There's a lot of hard work ahead of us. After 24 years in Midland ISD, developing a track record for turning schools around, Joanna Carrillo Rally says she's ready for a new challenge. First day, I'm here. But really, she's been walking these halls for a month, helping train teachers on a new way of thinking. You've got to get out of that mindset that you are defeated. And a new way of teaching. In English. They may be making dioramas based on the characters uh, that they're working on. And so a lot of hands-on, project-based learning. Something else the director has been doing, old-fashioned phone calls to families who were planning on taking their kids somewhere else. She was able to convince 100 of them to walk back through these doors in the fall. The school that I know, the school I love. PTA President Robert Kibbe was a student here 30 years ago and has faith the Texas T-STEM Coalition will bring success to the campus that helped his own children succeed. Oh, I, I want it bad. I mean, I, I want to see it bad. The director's own daughter will be a sixth grader here in the fall. If I can't lead the teachers in the campus to be the best for my own child, then I'm not doing my job. Under pressure as the new leader and a parent to perform at a whole new level in Southeast Austin. Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News. The PTA president says 44 out of the 67 teachers at Mendez are coming back. The new director is working on filling the vacancies and will have round two of teacher training in a couple of weeks. And this isn't the first time Austin ISD has gone with an in district charter. After a year of running the old Allen Elementary School, the school board decided to cancel the contract with Idea Public Schools in 2012. Community members voiced concerns that they were not included in the decision to bring in Idea. The charter went on to open its own campuses in Austin, and it's still expanding. Travis Heights Elementary is the only current in-district charter. It was formed in 2012 and allows the school more freedom with teaching styles and curriculum.